uh, it's always nice to uh, to get a win, uh, your first win here at home, and it was it was nice to be back in the barn after uh, a long weekend last weekend playing against three top teams. Uh, was very pleased with our defense once we got uh, once we got started um, after the first four or five minutes of the game. But uh, you know I thought our defense really held the fort down for a majority of the game. Um, very pleased with that. I was pleased with our rebounding efforts, and uh, obviously our offense has uh, has a long ways to go. It usually does this time of the year. Um, our defense and our rebounding in that end of the floor is way ahead of our offense, and and uh, we've got a lot of work to do at that end. But was very pleased with the effort from uh, Sari today, and. And uh, obviously, Key's leadership out there, I thought she kept our team mentally tough out there today when uh, we kind of got off to a rocky start. Um, but we got to do a better job finishing in the paint. Um, we missed a lot of shots in the paint. And you look up at the scoreboard, and I think we had nine points with uh, 11 and a half minutes uh, um, to go in the first half. So um, I thought we were getting great shots, and we just got to do a better job finishing. That's our guards and our posts. Talk about the 20 to 3 scoring run that ended the first half. Minnesota. I think at the point made just four of the first 14 shots and looked like some of the effects carried over from the first weekend. All of a sudden, we saw some rhythm. I, I thought we did too. I thought, uh, I think during that time, I think Siri knocked the three down. I think we got some steals on defense and it was really playing really a high octane, uh, you know, offense. We were letting our defense score some some points for us and, you know, I thought we looked outstanding during those uh, four or five minutes, but that was about it. So the rest of the game seemed uh, pretty difficult. And what do you expect out of Sari this year? You know, she played a reserve role for you guys last year, about 10 minutes a game. And what, what do you hope to get from her, and what, what have you liked so far? Well, I think Sari's still really, I think she's still a very young player. And, you know, I think just some consistency from Sari, and I think her, her game is, is continuing to evolve. And, you know, I think the, the biggest thing is for Sari to bring toughness to our team. I think that's the biggest thing that she does besides her shooting is she's, just tough. She's a tough player and not afraid to get in there and get dirty and on the floor. And I think that gets contagious with the rest of our team. And then, you know, she, you know, obviously knocking some shots down and playing great defense. And I just think her game is evolving and her just kind of growing and becoming a better player. Did you see some of that in that stretch? You know, early when you went from them getting some pretty good looks to all of a sudden clamping down on them, was she a part in that, did you think, in sort of mixing it up? Absolutely. I, you know, I thought uh, um, O'Reilly, uh, number one, was really hurting us at the beginning of the game, and we made a matchup or we made a matchup change with uh, who was defending her. And I thought Sari did a great job shutting her down. She might have scored one or two baskets the rest of the game, but I thought she did a great job getting through screens and just being there on the catch with uh, a really good three-point shooter. I think she's shooting 57% from the three-point line right now, and uh, you just can't give those types of shooters open open looks. Sari, last year your previous career high was 10 and that was early in the season against Dayton. Then you've been kind of quiet now at 16. Are you turned a corner in a sense? I guess what, uh, how do you feel today in terms of rhythm and confidence? Um, like Coach said, I think I brought some toughness and just getting to the basket and stuff. I didn't shoot, make all my points off of threes or anything, get into the basket, and I think just it's just something we needed today. And I don't know, I just had a better game. And it, referring to like how we did earlier last year and earlier this year, I just want to from now, keep growing from where I got today, so I don't want to just settle at this. Are you trying to be more aggressive today? Um, I think I, as compared to last weekend, yes, I was more aggressive, um, taking the ball to basket and learning to finish a little bit better and stuff, so I think that I was a little more aggressive today. Siri, what, what, you probably didn't play as well as you wanted to offensively a week ago with your shooting. Did you try to do some other things and kind of not worry about that coming into today? Yeah, absolutely. I think that getting easier shots, I mean, a layup is a better percentage shot than a three-point shot. So um, getting my confidence up by getting some shots in the lane and then hopefully extending it out a little bit more and becoming more consistent out there, I think that definitely helped me out today. Do you like to guard people? Yeah. <laughs> what do you try to do when you're, when you're playing defense? Um, I, when I have the challenge of trying to stop someone if they're, you know, scoring a lot, I just want to shut them down completely, not let them score again, take them out of the game. Kiara, five assists, one turnover today. Are we seeing, I guess, more ball, a better ball handler representing a point guard slash shooting guard than what we saw last year? I think so. I mean, I think, you know, I'm a, I'm a senior. I think people know that I'm going to try and look to score. And so I think when a lot of people close in on me, a lot of other people are open. So I think 
for me, I just try to hit other people in the open, and people do a great job of finishing, and I don't really, you know, notice it. I think it comes natural and when we play and swing the ball. Kara, what, what do you think of what Sari brought to you guys today? Sari? Yeah. Uh, I thought Sari did great. I mean, obviously I know what Sari can do. I see her in practice all the time, and I feel like if she can just bring her toughness in the games and just be consistent, like, she's a great piece to our team, and... Um, it's a little thing that she can not only shoot, she makes the basket, she has great defense. So I think um, she really came out and displayed that today, and I think it helped us a lot. Pam, you talked earlier about how defense is ahead of offense at this time of the year. Is, is toughness part of that? They you, you kind of got to be tough and scrapped before, you know, until the offense get, gets moving? It is. You know, I think, you know, if you have a great defense and you can rebound the basketball, um, you're always going to put yourself in a position to always uh, be in a position to win a basketball game, even if it's a great team like Florida State this past weekend. And you're always going to be in a position to win. And, you know, and I think it really creates um, some transition opportunities for us because I think we're a better transition team this year. So if we can defend and we can get some scoring off of our defense and rebound the ball well, we can get more transition. And, you know, we've got a lot of work to do on, on our on our half court execution and, and that'll come. We just gotta continue working hard at it. Any other questions?